What's up, Empire? It's your boy, Emrod. How y'all living? And we're back with Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Now, look, where we left off is, uh, I got rescued on, by these two people, I can't remember their names right now, uh, from, uh, being attacked, uh, on the train that it was blowing up when I was, uh, trying to escape the Empire. And uh, the second sister caught up to me, and I had to fight her. And obviously, I couldn't win because one, I don't know how to beat <laughs> somebody else with a lightsaber yet. And uh, also, uh, I think he, I think with uh, his name's Cal. I think with Cal, he's um, he had some Jedi training, but he never probably completed it because. Um, when his master died by the hands of the Empire, uh, after the Republic was taken, um, he had to go into hiding. So I, I think that I think that's a brilliant idea of uh, how to take somebody uh, and place it in the Star Wars universe, so that you know it fits right in with the uh, whole span of it. So uh, right now I'm gonna find out. Uh, where exactly I'm gonna, I'm gonna do? What exactly I'm gonna do? Where I'm gonna go? This kind of reminds me of a little bit of the uh, Enterprise. What is that? Is that a guitar? Seriously? He's got. Is, does he know how to play guitar too? It's almost like a sitar. That song. I wrote it. Really? Years ago. You touch an object and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. Huh. It's an echo in the force from the object. Many Jedi have that skill. That is interesting. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi. She was? But not anymore. Do I know you? No. But I knew your master, General T'Pol. He was a true guardian of wow. the Republic. That's crazy. He was a hero. Listen. Something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but my connection to the Force is damaged. When I meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when... You survived, Cal. And you're not alone. Not anymore. We're coming up on our destination. Okay, so if he has a deep connection with the Force, that means he... If you lose control, it naturally means that you go dark side. So... He's trying to... He's probably trying to... Not connect to it so much this is that he goes dark side. A Jedi I knew discovered it before the Purge. You won't find it on any maps. The Empire doesn't know this place exists. No. That's hard to believe. So, what's the plan? We hide out here? We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the hmm. Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the Force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But, until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. Who's that? May the Force be with you. Wait, is this Dagoba? I might, I might, I think I missed it. Ugh. 
Yeah, I, I missed it when I was... Uh... Skill point acquired. Guess I'm looking for a Jedi then. But if there's already one here, why does Seer need me? I think it is Yoda. Uh, okay, just go around. Okay. I'm just trying to figure this out. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> uh, ah! About this. Okay. Maybe just go around. This looks like a safe place to meditate. Just need to focus meditate. my mind. All I know how to do is meditate. Even though I'm on a different planet, I still gotta celebrate. <laughs> okay, the save points are located throughout Cal's journey. Make sure you interact to save your progress. Save points are where Cal can rest and spend new skills to acquire new skills. Okay. So, it is, uh... It, it is a, uh... In a way... Sorry, I'm yawning. Uh, it is in a way, like, uh... An RPG, like, uh, Final Fantasy, uh, where you can, uh game points and just fill them to spend them to build your character so that's a really neat idea okay you have enough skill points to learn new skills open the skill tree all right so that's probably the only one i know so it's wow that's cool How, yeah, the monsters, that monster got decapitated, but he's just whole. <laughs> I don't get it. But this is, re th this to me is very reminiscent of uh, Final Fantasy X's uh, leveling up. Because they had like a sphere grid, much like this. So, I, I like how they like incorporate different aspects of different games that I've played. And uh, I love them all, by the way. Like Tomb Raider, I love the action packed. You got the puzzle solving, and you gotta try to get to your destination as fast as possible, especially on that train, um, with all the climbing and all that stuff. But also, like the, the fight, the fighting itself is um, is kind of it's kind of its own uh, unique thing that's new, but. I do like how they make things familiar, especially for, you know, gamers like me <laughs> who appreciate this kind of thing, so. So, okay, I learned that ability. Oh, I think resting fills my health. I... Oh. Hey, BD1. BD1. I'm Cal. Don't confuse it with BD Wong. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, not you. I'm searching for a, a Jedi, I think. Hold on. Y you know the Jedi? How what can you, know? you understand? Wait, hold on. Did you just slice that? Thanks. That's cool. That's like my very own R2. Except it's BD Wong. I'm always gonna call it BD Wong now. <laughs> That's the Vault Seer mentioned. Whoever I'm supposed to find must be waiting there. Okay. Ah. So now we have a map. All right, cool. I like that. We zoom. Uh, this is cool. And it's like, it is like, um, I've seen this on, uh, which one was it? One of the newer Star Wars, they had like a hologram like this. It's pretty cool. I like it. How do I get out? 
How do I get up? No, that's not how I get up. Hollow map shows unexplored pathways and important landmarks, which is very useful. Um, cool. Close hollow map. Ready to proceed. Okay. Kind of wanna go this way. What the heck? I sense something over here. What do you sense? Oh. That's a really big bug. Ah. I think thick Jedi was part of exterminators. <laughs> That's a really cool new skill. Oh man. I really gotta watch how I fight because it's. Yeah, especially since I keep getting hit. What's this? Sense Echo. Was after boggling eggs in the pack fought back. Ah, so you can. Through a rare ability known as psychometry, metry, however you pronounce it, Cal can receive information from the forest when he touches certain items. Oh, okay. So it's kind of like his own personal uh, mind reading network or sensing. I don't know. You know what I mean. So that's cool. No way through here. Guess that's why BD1 warned me. All right, maybe I'll listen to you next time. Yeah, that's 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 pretty cool. I like that. I don't know if any of the any of the Star Wars movies had that. Uh, they could read what had happened in the past. Or what happened to a certain individual. I don't know. That, uh. Any ideas? Gotta get across this gap somehow. Yeah, zipline. Zip ah, that's awesome. <coughs> it's my own personal zipline. How'd you know that would work? Oh wait, that's a place to meditate. Ah. Life and force have been restored, enemies have respawned. Uh, I guess that's the kicker to it. Um. I hear you, but there's something over here I want to explore. Yeah. I mean, we could get to the main objective and all that. But, but let me take a little time to explore while I'm not fighting some enemies. Or if you can fall off of those, maybe if you move too quick. Flashlight. It makes sense. It makes sense. I like how they're just using everything you can, like multi-purposing, like the lightsaber, not just as a fighting tool or to defend, but just as a flashlight. That thing looks like it smells worse than grease Ooh. does. That looks mean. Oh my gosh! Holy shit! Ah. Alright, we're back at the meditation spot, so I'm gonna try that again. If 
doesn't seem worth it, I might skip it, but uh, I don't really want to skip something that can give me a large amount of XP or maybe some kind of treasure. Weed whacking. Oh! Dang it. The lumen. Okay, I gotta find a way to beat this guy. seems like I can't parry on that giant frog. So, we'll try it. He said just before enemy attacks, parry. Uh. <sighs> Sorry, I'm yawning. It's like 8 o'clock in the morning right now, and I woke up like at 7. I'm still not fully awake yet. I'm trying to record this so I can get the one video out and get this one video out tomorrow. At least. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. You know what? Let's go down here first. No, no, no. Look at it. I, I gotta beat that frog. That Ooga Booga, I think that was called. I guess I gotta block once and then hit, or and then I gotta mix the block, the parry in with the evading. Uh, or I can slow him. I forgot about that. Oh, oh you can't. fast. What is that? Oh! No, 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 no. <laughs> that thing is... That thing is watching me. I set it to like the. I pretty much set it on hard difficulty. Uh, like I could force power it. But I gotta figure out what that thing. You know what? I'm gonna check out the. Fan. Fan. First. Check out this fan first. It might give me a different power. Okay. What 
is this place? What is this place? Right. Um, can I climb up this? No, I can't. Jedi used this place uh, to study the sphere above. Oh, okay, so you can, I can still feel the excitement. Force powers. Ah, it shut the Cool. I feel like this should be a way to get up to the. Nothing I can do here. Let me get to this. Try to defeat that massive frog again. If I can beat him. I'll be happy for this episode. <laughs> should have played more Dark Souls before playing this. Because Dark Souls is all about the evade hit, evade hit, evade hit. I don't know. I don't think I could do that. 
the way this thing is. Can't be dead. <sighs> Alright, just for this one thing. It's so frustrating. I'm gonna change difficulty. Okay, so let's do that. Just for now. Because this guy is super tough. I gotta beat you. I gotta beat you. Yes, I beat it. Through uh, no help of changing the difficulty at all. But I'm kidding. I had to change it to story mode, which is the easy part. Where Boggling was killed. Was it trying to defend its family? Ah. Uh. Okay, so. Not only in the sense that it's like Tomb Raider and, uh, what's the other game I said? Uh, uh, has some aspects of different games like Batman, well, maybe not Batman, but like, uh, uh Final Fantasy X with the level up system, but it also has God of War, uh, where you collect different, uh, you collect, like, different, uh, Essences like your force essence and your life essence, and it raises it up. So that's pretty cool. What's in here though? Nothing. Okay. So. Let's change it back. Can't play. Jedi Master. Okay. So I beat that giant frog. Now we're gonna go the way we need to go. You can go your own way. Oh. Whoa, Jesus, <laughs> you guys spazzing out there. Alright. There is something shiny over there. Okay. Oh, I got this long. Careful over there. That doesn't look safe. <laughs> Just like back yep, at the scrap. Exactly like the scrapyard. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> Hold on, anyone. I'm yeah, I gotta save my buddy. Underground. That was cheap. All right. What's in here? Go in 
that door? No. I guess the only way to go is through forcing it. Ooh. Hey, that was pretty yeah. brave. You're the brave you little okay? buddy. Oh, it's damaged though. Wait, I can help you with that. Will you let me? Oh. <laughs> okay. That's the one thing about Star Wars is you have like your little robot buddies. Like the original, you have R2. Well, uh, the new this complex is busted, but this, one you have this should help you get moving for now. This is cool. I, I like that aspect of Star okay. Wars. That's like one of my Try that. Uh, tropes. The vault. Yeah, that's where I was headed too. Okay. Well. First, we've got to figure out a way yeah. out of this place. Customized lightsaber? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Ooh, I could do the color. I could do blue, green, orange. Ooh. Let's, let's see how it looks. Let's see how it looks. Whoa. That's pretty cool. Orange for sunshine saber, saber. <laughs> Let me, uh, you know what? I prefer green. Green's my favorite color. So, green emitter. Oh, okay. Uh, I think I like this one the best. Just switches too. Oh, okay, that's a switch. I like that. That's cool. Material. I like that. You know what? That. Nice. Man, that's cool. I like how they put that addition to it. Cause a lot of a lot of Star Wars fans, including myself. We've always dreamed of having our own custom lightsabers. Uh, and, yeah, that was just... I know there's a place that you can make your own custom lightsabers and people bring it to, like, cons and stuff like that, so... Uh, BD, that's a little small yeah. for me. Don't worry, I'll find my own way uh, out. Tight fit, but this should work. Nice. I like the green. Blue's cool too. But uh. Oh. Okay, good. Hold on. Let's see if there's anything else. Like... The bed. Oh, oh, wait. I could examine it. I said I could examine something. Those vines look like oh, they okay. lead somewhere. Hope they're sturdy. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> oh, okay. Jumped off there. Whoa. I was a little skeptical of that, actually. Why did I do that? Yeah, I'm all right. <coughs> can you heal me? Yes, you can. Healing stem. You're full of yeah. surprises. Where were you when I had the frog fight? That's better. Thanks, little droid. Thanks, BD Wong. Okay, let's try this again. You're a great doctor, especially on the Velociraptors. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Here, hop on board. Sweet. Okay. Well, I had to do that. So, how'd you get here? Don't remember? I've never known a forgetful hmm. droid. Can't argue with that. 
Okay. Ah, so I'm right there. That's where I was. Is that the vault? Bogana. Okay, so this isn't, uh... I think it was the city Yoda was from. I know I said earlier, uh... Okay, cut a rope. Uh, okay, that's a shortcut for the, uh... What's in here? Hey, a chest. Think the Jedi would mind if we grab supplies? Where are you going? It's like a washing machine. Oh, something was in there. Need it required. Oh, okay. So you can collect... You can collect different uh, lightsaber parts throughout the game. That's pretty cool. That's where we need to go. Yeah, that's where we it. need to go. What's in these buildings? Uh, nothing. They're just for show, I guess. Oh, giant bugs. Oh. there yet uh, back backtracking yeah because I gotta figure out I, I like this exploration Star Wars you can break through What's in here? Let's get going, BD1. That might, might be more life essence. Whoever lived here used this room oh, for storage. Point. They kept food and supplies. Okay. Cool. Um. All right. So let's keep exploring. Dinosaur over there. Uh, as much as I want to get over there, I don't think I can right now. So let's zip line over here and the Great Divide. <laughs> you mapped everywhere we've been. Yeah. Okay, so it does tell me. Okay, that's cool. I can't make it over there. We gotta yeah. find another way. Okay, so I gotta turn around. Um. Um. I don't want to just jump off and... Oh, okay. There's... Oh, you're dead. <laughs> Ooh. The little lightsaber part? Oh, okay. Did you find yeah, something, BD1? Yeah, found something. Poncho material. You can change your poncho in the pause menu. Customization. Ah, cool. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, you can change BD1s. Ugh. I think I like them that way better. Oh, and you can change the color of your ship, too. 
Uh, let's keep it original until I find something better. Okay, there's a rope right there. Nice. Ah, oh, meditation point. I think I'm gonna stop it right here after I pick a skill point. Let's see. Yep, I know. Resting is not required to save your progress. Resting will respawn enemies. I don't think I need to rest right now. Let's just go to the skill tree. Okay. Uh. Hold on. Okay. Cal's maximum force is increased. Maximum life is increased. Let's, uh. Cal dashes toward attacks his heart. Jump while dashing. Flip over the target instead. Okay. Let's get that. Oh, I have to hold it. I forgot. Okay. So I could bum rush him like that. Or I could jump over. That would definitely been necessary for that frog. Alright. Cool. So... So, I think I'm going to leave leave it right here, guys. Um, so far, so far, like I said, I love everything, how they laid out the game, the story so far, and um, just the customization abilities, like with your lightsaber and your force powers and just skins uh, that we just saw for, like, your character, BB-8, and the ship. I think that's awesome. And, uh... BB-8, <laughs> BD Wong, one. I know it's. I keep saying Wong, but that helps me remember it. Uh, yeah, he's he's a helpful little dude. Um, but yeah, if you guys like this uh, playthrough, just uh, smash the like button, comment. Uh, if you if you've played this so far, see what, tell me what you think of it, um, or some tips. And uh, subscribe if you're new. Uh, join the Empire, become a citizen today. But right now, this is Emrod, your boy, signing off.